Well, that's not the only one that might come off child. So don't mind me. Excuse the ghetto. <laughs> Hey friends, welcome to my channel, Cat Eye Glamour, our little hangout where we can be the most glamorous versions of ourselves. If you are new here, my name is Marilyn and I'm bringing you all things beauty, fashion, glamour, lifestyle, all that, all that, all that. So why are you not subscribed yet? Why are you not subscribed yet? Hit the button. Not playing. So how are you feeling my little wavy bob here? I am basically the same hairstyle I had before, but you guys know I get tired of hairstyles pretty quickly and I change up pretty quickly. I put some double twist in my hair and just kind of like, you know, made it wavy and like a messy little cute bob. And I think it, you know, it brought me back to life. Brought me back to life. So I hope y'all like it. And I know y'all see this glossy gloss, okay? Glossy gloss. Don't forget, I am launching so soon. These are my glosses that I formulated and I put together. The ones that I have on right now are Flan and um, Honey Glaze. I actually have a little sample here because I just did a little video for Instagram so I had the samples with me so this is honey glaze and I also mix it with a, a nude cream this is a cream gloss that one is a glaze this is called um flan so I mix those so these are the sample jars so that's why I use it because it's still products and I use it because I love them and you guys see how glossy my lips look if you like a nice silky glossy gloss you're gonna love these and I can't wait for you guys to get your hands on them we're going to be launching really soon, I would say in about the next week and a half. Um, but we've started production, like I'm making the sugar scrubs and doing all that good stuff. So excited. So stay tuned for that. I'll have the things, um, the IG page linked below. So once the website is actually live, you guys will be the first to know. So let's get on to why we are here. And it's because I have a Pat McGrath haul for you guys. Um, Pat McGrath had a sale going on, you know, I was minding my business, like I talked to you guys about in a vlog, um, one of my um, vlogmas vlogs. I was minding my business, I was online, and I seen a damn banner from Pat McGrath saying 25% off, 30% off, and I was like, okay, I'm very much interested, <laughs> okay, so I clicked that, ended up getting some lipsticks, um, and also an eyeshadow palette. I have the, the package here, it came yesterday, and I didn't open it at all, because I wanted it to be a first impressions. Um, I love those type of videos, so you can get my true reaction to what I feel about the products. And I will swatch um, the eyeshadow palettes, and I'll also swatch the lipsticks on my lips. So I'm gonna have to wipe my lip gloss off, but it's all good, because I can put it back on. Okay. So here is the box, just so you guys know, I did not open this, it's still, together so let's go ahead and open it and then we'll start looking at what we got i'm excited it's christmas it's christmas <laughs> so i'm trying to open this and my nails like i've had these press on nails for i think yesterday made two weeks and they're like hanging on by a thread child i'm trying not to be too rough because i don't want to pop them and i don't want to look ghetto here on camera with the nail missing but i don't know y'all <laughs> i might have to have a nail missing but let me try to, this is really, I'll be back, I'll be back, hold on, I'll be back. <laughs> the box is open, girl, and I love Pat McGrath, like I, I love the way she packages her boxes. So this is the box here, so I don't think I can see all those sequency and all those cutesy, you know, let's get into it, girl, let's get into it, let's get into it. So the first thing that we have here that's in the, that has all the sequences, oh, that nail is missing. It did, it did come off. Well, that's not the only one that might come off, child. So don't mind me. Excuse the ghetto. <laughs> but this is the palette that I brought. It's called the um, the Eye Ecstasy Sublime Eyeshadow Palette. And these are the colors here on the back. But of course, we're gonna um, we're gonna swatch them. So this is it. This is the first package. And then I also got some some lipsticks. Oh my gosh, sorry. Let me fix y'all, it's kind of cricket. All right, there we go. <laughs> so I got three lipsticks here. Look at the packaging. Girl, seriously? Seriously? Everywhere else needs to step up their packaging. Look at this. So these are the three lipsticks that I got. Um, the colors that I got were $19.95, which if I remember right, it's a nudie color. $19.95, I also got Full Panic, I don't remember what type of color that is. And I also got Elson. And these say 
the type of finish it is, it says matte trance. So I'm, these are matte finish uh, lipsticks. So let's get these open and dig right in. So I'm gonna start with these so I can swatch them on my lips so y'all can see how they look or whatever, okay? How cute are these boxes? Honestly, they have a little string here that you can wrap around to close it, but you just unwind it and it just folds up like this. How? How pretty. And then let's grab the lipstick. Let's see what that looks like. Wow. Wow. See, these lipsticks belong on top of your vanity. Like, you don't put these, you don't store these away. These are out for decoration. Like, look at this lipstick. The packaging is so high quality. Let me tell y'all. So high quality. So, I'm going to swatch them on my hands first and then we'll get into the try on portion. But this is a lipstick when you wind it up. Do you see this new? I'm gonna swatch it on my hand first, but if, like I said, I'm gonna put it on my lips too. So this is like a rosy nude. This is gonna be so good. I feel like I have a color similar to this. The texture was very smooth on my hand. I can't wait to try it on my lip, but this is a $19.95 and honey. And I got, the, the sale price was $12 that I got them for. Normally her, her lipsticks are like $30 or something like that. I know I have lip glosses in there, $30. Expensive but the quality is very high. This is a luxury item. So this is if you feel like treating yourself, you feel like splurging and just saying, you know what, throw it in the bag. <laughs> throw it in the bag, ask questions later. See now me, I waited for this to be on sale. Just saying. But I do have lip glosses that I paid full price for that I did a video on many months ago. So you guys can check it out. I'll try to link it, but I have the, her lip gloss, anyway, I'm off track. I'll just check the link. All right, so the next one that we're gonna look at is another matte lipstick, and this one is called Elsin, and it comes in this black and white sort of packaging. The same, um, you know, stringy thing in my jigger. So we just flip it up, and then we're gonna go ahead and open it. This looks so gorgeous. They're so like heavy, like very high quality. So this is Elsin, let's open that up. I don't remember, what am I doing? How did I open the first one? Wait a minute now. Oh, what am I doing? Okay. <laughs> okay, now how many of me does it take to open a damn lipstick too? But I don't know, for this, for some reason, this one was harder to open. So this one is Elsin. So this is the color. Frank, listen. Is this not the perfect red? Look at this, let me show you again. Baby, let's swatch it and see how she swatches. I'm gonna swatch it right next to the first one. Look at this red. Girl, do you see how opaque that is? All right, now the little holiday looks are gonna be coming up because this is a perfect lipstick for like a Christmas glam, holiday glam, and y'all gonna get it, don't worry. Don't worry. But that was, what was it called, Icon? What did I say? Oh, Elson. Elson. Why, where did I get Icon? Elson. So that was Elson. Let's, so let's get into the other one. These lipsticks are the shit. So girl, clearly I have not been disappointed in the least bit so far. So the next color that we have is Full Panic. Full Panic. So this is a tube of Full Panic. I really like this one. I really like this tube. So let's flip her up. These packaging, the packaging is so good. Like it makes everyone else look dumb. For lack of a better word, everyone else looks dumb. Because <laughs> this packaging is so good. So let's pop it open, okay? So this is the color here. Ooh. It's like a it's like a matte. It has like a little bit of a like a film over it. I think that's a part of the whole matte formula. But it's like a pinky color. This looks really pretty. This is a really pink color. I'm gonna swatch it, look. See, it's a first impression, so I'm I'm seeing it for the first time just like you guys. So, let me swatch Full Panic. Oh, bitch. Let me let y'all see it, let me stop playing. Look at this. Look at that. Y'all, I when I tell you I love a good, bright, matte pink, during the summer, that's, that's what I like, that's what I wear. That's what I wear. Girl, let's get these damn lipsticks on my lip, okay? 
let's get the lipsticks on my lips so we can really get the full 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 effect let's get into it all right so i wiped off my um my lip gloss and i'm gonna line my lips with a juvia's place lipstick which is called coco i love to use this as a lip liner and then i'll try those on so i'm just gonna try it on how i would normally wear them so i'll just go ahead and do that This is like the perfect lip liner for me. Okay, so we have that on. And now we're gonna do, I'm gonna start with the lightest color because just in case these stain, I don't want them to, you know, disrupt the actual, you know, the actual tone of the lipstick. So let's start with 1995. So let's do this here. So I'm just gonna use the camera as my mirror. So if you see me looking away, that's what I'm doing clearly. <laughs> so. Mm, this is a matte. It's a pretty pale shade. I feel like I have something like this. It's really pretty though. Really pretty. So definitely I'm glad I put a lip liner on because if I hadn't put one on first, that would have scared this would have scared me. But let me back up so you can see. This is gorgeous, honestly. This is gorgeous, girl. This looks like um from the Juvia's Place collection. I think it's called Kevy or you know what? Let me go grab it because I have. Yeah, I think um 1995 is very similar to me by Juvia's Place, and that's me right there. It's This is um, 1995, and this is me. Me is a lot more, a little bit darker in uh, tone, but it's pretty much the same thing. So that's a really good dupe by Juvia's Place. Just in case you, you know, you wanted to know. But 1995 is gorgeous. The formula is actually perfect. It's very lightweight, like feather lightweight. It's It doesn't feel drying at all. It's really nice. It's a really nice look. And it's a pretty new. Like it looks really good with the um the brown that I lined it with. So this is definitely a go. I love, I love, I love this color. Okay, so let's move on to the next one. So the next color that we're gonna go for is the red one, Nelson. I already put a little lip liner on. So I'm just gonna get right into it. These are so smooth. So here we have Elson. Elson looks grown. Elson looks like she pays her own bills and she wears very expensive perfume. Elson is a boss, okay? Elson is the boss. Love this lipstick. I love a nice red. Red is so mature, so sexy, so elegant, so classy, classic. Everyone should own a red. There's different shades of red that can fit each and every skin tone. So this is a really, really nice red i love it i wish it was more matte though i wish it was more matte so, you know um what was that tutorial that i did the, the wing liner i had a red on from kat von d it's called outlaw that red is perfect because it's very matte this one has a little bit of a sheen and when it comes to red i like it to be completely matte but the tone the color is still gorgeous but if i could wave a magic wand it would be more matted if you know what i mean but i like it though still popping i'm still gonna wear it okay so i did wipe off the red lipstick but clearly it stained my lips so that's what reds do so let's go ahead and get into the next one which is full panic the pink one so let's try that one on So pretty. The thing is, though, because I have that red, I feel like it's no, it still comes through. I don't want the stain to like mess up what it truly looks like, but I can absolutely see the color coming through, girl. It's a really nice pink. Ooh, I really like this. I love pink. I love pink. Let me back up a little bit so you guys can really see. I really like this color. I love it. I love it. I love it. I 
should have put some concealer on my lips and then put it on. But that's too late. But you guys, you still get the gist. You still see that it's a very nice, pigmented, very smooth formula. Extremely smooth. It looks great. It looks, I just love it. I love it. I love makeup, y'all already know. I love lip products and I love complexion products a lot. But this is Full Panic. So now let's get into the eyeshadow palette that I picked up, which is this fun guy here. Um, so clearly, I'm going to need scissors to open this. It's not like a, a resealable pouch. So let me grab some scissors. I'm not even going to put y'all through watching me trying to open it. I've got it out of the packaging, and this is the packaging here for the eyeshadow palette. This is really cute to me. The packaging is... They're all, it never fails really with time grass. So this is it here. It has five colors in it. I'm gonna go ahead and open it up. Show y'all the colors. Okay. These are all shimmery, bronzy, metallic -y sort of colors. So this is it here. Super gorgeous. I'm gonna go ahead and just um, swatch these colors for you, all five, and we'll see how they look. But I'm gonna take a guess that they're gonna be the shit, <laughs> okay? Just a guess. So the, let's swatch the first color here. Swatch it on my hand. There it is. Oh my, do you see that? How, look how wet that looks. Wow. Sorry, there's makeup on my hand. Y'all already know. So I tried to wipe lipsticks off, but they, they stained. So this is that first color. You saw how smooth that swatch was, right? Gorgeous. I'm, I told you it was probably going to be the shit. So let's swatch the next color, which is a. Wow. I've never had a color like this. I don't know. It's almost like a duochrome. It like it changes the tone. It looks. This was the color that I swatched, so you guys can see. I swatched this, but it looks like. In person, it's almost like a duochrome. Like it goes to like a raspberry bronze, then it goes to like a golden, like a brownie bronze. I don't know, but it's complicated. <laughs> it's complicated. So I'm gonna go ahead and swatch that right next to the other one. So this is it, what I just swatched here. That is a gorgeous color. These formulas are so smooth. Wow. Beyond impressed right now. Go to, I'm going to go ahead and swatch that color now. Wow, so smooth. These are so smooth. It's almost like, you know, like when you do, look at that. You know, like when you do your makeup and you wet your brush to like pack on color and make it more metallic. This texture is almost as if you have a wet brush, you know what I'm saying? And it, it comes off smooth automatically. So I can only imagine if I did, you know, like wet my brush a little bit while doing my eyeshadow. It'll come off really super metallic. All right, so let's go for that brown color. Let's just get here on my hands. And we're gonna swatch it here, wow. So pretty. And then let's do the last color. So that is the, look how this is serious pigment look at the shine y'all better get into this i got the palette for on sale it was 14 dollars y'all know y'all know how expensive pat mcgrath is you know if you're into makeup and you know about pat mcgrath you already know the price is very much up there very much up there but i got this for 14 dollars on the sale i'm guessing she just has new Thing is coming out for the new season and she has to get rid of the older inventory so of course it goes on sale and i'm happy to grab it up okay y'all so that is the end of my pat mcgrath try on haul i really hope you enjoyed it i got distracted i saw my hand in my peripheral <laughs> i saw my hand in the um the camera here and i'm like this is like ridiculous it's good. but i hope you guys enjoyed this video i certainly enjoyed swatching it for you and I hope you enjoyed my review and my first impressions and all that and I hope you come back don't forget to like the video subscribe you can share me with friends duh share me let's you know let's allow the squad to grow and flourish okay thank you so much for watching don't forget to check the links below